What if I told you that making one simple change to your morning could affect the rest of your day? You see, I found myself in an issue. And the issue was that I was constantly overwhelmed by everything. We live in a time where robots are happening. I am the latest and greatest robot from Hanson Robotics. Cars are self-driving. Everyone has their own personal computer in their pocket, other known as an iPhone or a smartphone. And that is so awesome. But don't you think sometimes it can become so overwhelming? You wake up and you check your phone before you say good morning to your girlfriend, boyfriend or spouse, you have an addiction. And like all addiction, in time it'll destroy relationships, it'll cost time, and it'll cost money, and it'll make your life worse. You see, I go through phases of different things I'm into and different things I research, but in the past couple of months I've got into researching mindfulness. Basically just being here in the present moment and being able to relax. So I read countless books, audio books, Hundreds of YouTube videos. First thing was that I committed to charging my phone in another room, not right at my bedside. Just all on basically mindfulness. And the common tip was change your morning routine. And these people seem to get it, you know, they seem to really understand how to be relaxed. They understood that there needs to be a time to detach yourself from technology. And from that, I took it upon myself to make a change to my own life for the better. So I went out and I bought an eight euro alarm clock. I take my iPhone at nighttime and I turn it off. And this is where the change happens. All of a sudden you find yourself completely disconnected from everything. I'm the type of person that my morning routine consisted of. Alarm goes off, I wake up, I check my Instagram notifications, I check my Facebook notifications, I check my Facebook Messenger, I check my emails, my messages, then I go on to YouTube and this is mind boggling. I'm not lying, I'm not trying to build that up. That was my morning routine. And I'd say for most of you, it is the exact same, you know? We, we just have this kind of routine that we just automatically do. But take that out of the equation. Take that routine and see how you feel then. What's, what's going through your head then? Because that's how I felt in the first morning. So this was different. With, with all those silenced, my morning routine changed and it changed for the better. They say that the beginning of the day is the deciding factor in the rest of your day. In a sense that if you wake up completely anxious and like overwhelmed by all the crap that you received over the night time, then the chances are your day is gonna be pretty similar. But you wake up and you wake up to the noise of the birds and, and nothing really other than an alarm clock and you, you decide yourself how you're gonna feel. I found myself going downstairs, making my morning coffee, and literally just sitting outside listening to the birds. As weird as that sounds, that was just nice. Or reading a book, or just something different, or even just having a conversation with your family. I made this video for a reason. I made this video to really share my message and my advice to kind of change your morning routine. But I don't want to force anyone to use my new alarm technique because that that doesn't mean anything. I'm not here to force anyone to do anything. But what I am trying to say is that putting on the phone every day for even a little while is really not a bad thing. If anything, it's a great thing. We live in this incredible world where incredible things happen every single day. And as I quote from my favorite film, Life moves pretty fast. You don't stop and look around once in a while. You could miss it.